Two people and a dog are dead after an explosion in Virginia Beach on Monday. Now fire investigators are giving us an up close look at some of the damage and told 13 News Now about their investigation. Emily Harrison also spoke to neighbors who witnessed this tragedy. I shed some tears over this. Like I didn't even know these folks, but it just it just it hurt like it just hit me in my heart. Aaron Gillum says the explosion sounded more like a car crash. He says he raced outside looking towards Virginia Beach Boulevard, but instead saw a cloud of smoke and the business Neptune's welding on fire. I see one guy at the Lee Papa's body shop looking back to see what's going on. So he's walking over. I'm walking over seeing what's going on. I see there's a lot of folks around and it's, it's just a whole bunch of smoke and someone said there was an explosion in one of the units and I'm like, Okay, uh, I'm, I'm like nervous. I'm thinking, well, what can I do? Can I can we get can we jump in there and save whoever it is? But in my mind, it's an explosion. Virginia Beach Fire Captain James Ingledew says the explosion is better described as a fireball, showing 13 News Now these photos of the damage left behind that investigators believe started because of a welding accident. Pretty large concussion, causing some of the walls to bow a little bit. Uh, engulfing the whole room in fire, which then would ignite any other combustible in the room uh, on fire. Ultimately, Ingledew said the explosion most likely started with a fuel oil container, but investigators cannot exactly say what liquid started the reaction. Emily Harrison, 13 News Now. Virginia Beach Fire Department Captain James Ingledew says they are not releasing the names of the two people killed by the explosion yet and that only minor damage occurred to any nearby businesses.